We have with us today the star of the new film Turtle Fuckers, uh, Jake Turtlefuck. <laughs> Sorry, is that your real? Coming soon from Galacto Records, the sounds of Guy in a Hole. With hits like this. Help! Help! Somebody help me! Help me! Help! Ah! Including classics like Why Me? <laughs> Why? Huh? No, nobody's here? You just grabbed that key card, huh? I mean, listen, no judgments here. You know, we do, who knows what that thing can do? Welcome to Pepperoni uh, Palace. I am Pete, the pepperoni salesman, and we are, we, today we have a great special. Get over here, come on. I, I, I'd rather not, I'd rather not, I'm gonna go. No, get over here, sit down, eat the pepperonis, come on. Eat I'm shot, the, I'm shopping, I'm my pepperonis, I'm Papo the pepperoni no, boy. I, listen, I really, I know I, they don't I, look like pepperonis, they're very bizarre and strange looking, but just eat it no, and, uh, I, I, stop, uh, you, you no, just have to eat it. Listen. took a peek at this place before now. But this is snazzy. The humans must be living it up here. Thanks for saving all of us, but you didn't have to save my cousin Bill. He's a real piece of shit. You know, this place is getting a little crowded. I can't find my wife. Oh, so let me... Let me get this straight. You like it here? Yep. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's a lot better than being trapped in a cage. You? Oh, yeah. Same. I like it here a lot more. A lot more than being trapped in a cage. My husband is still out there somewhere. Please save him. I don't love him or anything, but he owes me $12. Have you met Owen Wilson yet? Here's a hot tip. He's usually hanging out in the sex room. Okay, obviously we gotta use that key card we swiped from Clug's office. Sick secret area. Let's do it. Um, where the hell are we going? <laughs> Fuck yeah! We're going deeper. Oh, shit. This is a room full of dead humans. Fuck. Jesus. So the human haven was just a place to experiment on humans. This place keeps going clug? Oh, you backstabbing sack of shit. Oh, fuck the bounty hunter. How did they get here? Hey, dipshit. Chase the backstabbing politician! Please stop chasing me! Yeah, fat chance, dick! We're gonna chase the hell out of you! Clark, you didn't foolishly lead an interloper directly to us, did you? I, uh, uh... Ha, ha. I ask only as a formality. I already know the disappointing answer. 
I'm sorry, human, but this is what I thought was best for the cosmos. You just don't under... Now the question is, what do we do with you? You're the bounty hunter Klug manipulated into wiping out the G3, correct? We... Enough. Again, I already know the answer. Well, I'm interested. You're human. I have a very specific interest in humans. Would you mind if I cut you open and took a look inside? No way, you creep. What the hell is this place? Oh, my apologies. I'm Dr. Gurgula. Maybe you've heard of me. I'm sure your Gatlian friends have. I'm responsible for the plague that wiped out their entire race. Nothing personal, of course. I simply thought that they might be the key to my research. And when they weren't, well, what did it matter to me? What happened to them? Oh, you're like seriously evil. Psychopath evil. I'm a scientist. And I'm going to be the first being in existence to unlock the secrets of the universe. You, human, did you know your species has a very unique brain structure? And do you have the slightest inkling as to what it means? No, of course not. Therein lies the irony. Your special little brains hold a million wonderful secrets, and yet you can't even comprehend of them yourself. Much like a jar, unable to fathom its own contents. You'll forgive me for breaking the jar to get at what's inside, won't you? Newsflash, fucko! We're not letting you get away with this! Oh, yes, you are. And I can't allow any amount of my work here to be compromised. I hit the kill switch and wiped all my data the second I detected your presence back here. Good thing I've already gotten what I need. And as for you, well... I heard you already did your part in stopping Garmantuous and the G3. Well done, Bounty Hunter. You humans really do continue to impress me. Please watch your step on the way out. These experiments are very delicate. Okay, shit. That's a lot. That was a fucking lot. Maybe it'll get addressed in the sequel? Took you long enough to use me again? Jesus! Oh, you know I'm always game! fucking guys again. Hey there, Slim. That you didn't expect to see us. Looks like you figured out our dad, Klug, wasn't such a goody two-shoes after all. That'd teach you not to trust politicians. Not like you had a choice. Not like we had a choice either. That's right, kid. We're on your side for real. We hated that pompous yellow jagoff, but you? We like you. You've got Moxie, kid. We love Moxie. And now that Klug's out of the picture, we went ahead and did you the favor of rounding up all your little friends here. Don't worry. We're taking care of them. That's a promise. We're straight shooters. That means we don't shoot crooked. We'll make sure everyone's safe and sound. Not a hair on their heads, huh? You get that cute little planet of yours back up and running. Then we'll help you send everyone back home. No need to thank us. We just want to help. And we love how much moxie you got. We really do love that moxie. Take care, kid. Congrats on finding this whole secret part of the game. And thanks for cleaning up the trash. Yeah. This is too much for me. Let's just head home. What do you want? Because we got nothing. Yeah, we're fresh out of fun things to say. Except this, of course. But from here on out, we're giving you the silent treatment. We still like you, though. Yep. We still love that Moxie. Let's not kill them, okay? Nope. I don't want this blood on my hands. Come right over here, come. Oh, what's up? Hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come, uh, a few steps more. 